Hey, Mark Nelson here. And today what I want to do, I want to share with you a concept that I actually heard from a good friend of mine who's in the same business, John McLaughlin, if uh, I'd say his last name right. But he actually heard it from his one of his teammates, a, a woman by the name of Julie. And I really needed to hear it today. So if I needed to hear it, I think you might need to hear it. But they, he was talking about how to build an online business, building an online business. Uh, and the company I'm in is called LiveGood, which is just an amazing business. Uh, I, I would never have been in business unless this one came along again. But what she talked about and then he reiterated was, he says, you know, when you're building an online business, it's like what you need to do is put the blinders on. And when I first heard it, I thought, what's he talking about? But then he said, you know, like in a horse race, they put the blinders on a horse to keep focused on what's going on ahead of him. And I so needed to hear that today. And, you know, what it does is when you're building a business, right, there's just a lot of things that are going to happen. One, it, you don't go as fast as you want. Two, people say no. Three, you get somebody that's a hater that comes up and tries to say you and gets you off track. So you got to keep your blinders on. So you keep going forward. And what had happened to me, I made a post and a guy came out and said something negative about, um, the company and the leaders of the company, I need to do a review. And, and I thought, what the heck? So I actually went to his profile and it's really pretty funny because on his profile, this guy does rants all the time about everything, religion, politics, other people's businesses. And here's what usually happens when people do that. When you hear so many people knock you down, there's two reasons. One, they have a low self-esteem. And they aren't doing what they are trying to accomplish. So to make them feel better, they reach out and tell you that you aren't doing what you're supposed to be doing. Uh, so they kind of switch the blame. The second reason is they aren't doing what they're supposed to do in their business. So instead of encouraging you, they knock your business in either hopes that you stop and fail or that you turn around and say, oh, I want to join your business because your business is so cool. Hey, it just doesn't work that way. So if you're building an online business, and, and this is, and I hope you are, and I'm going to put a link down below uh, to take a tour for my company. It's just an amazing company uh, because we just encourage each other. In fact, what happens is we have a, um, I can't think of the word, a saying, that's not the word, that's what I'm going to say, a saying that, get to and bless others and that's how this business works see how the business works is i enroll two people so i built my business and every other person i enroll i'm helping other people build their business and that is so cool so i go out of the way and it's enrolling people helps me but i know i'm helping people that are inside my team so if you want to take a five minute tour it is marknells.com forward slash LGB and I'll put that link down below it'll be in probably in this video somewhere but remember you're building an online business or in anything you're trying to create put the blinders on you can do this follow through and do one step at a time that's all it is all it is so hey I hope that makes sense put your blinders on Build your business. If you're looking for a business or want to get on the top team, six of the top 10 in Live Good are on my team, which means whew, I'm excited because that they're going to help me build my business. So if you want to take a five minute tour of Live Good, the link's going to be below. MarkNells.com forward slash L G B. So Live Good Business. <laughs> Y'all take care. We will talk again soon. Bye.